Hi everyone, it's time for Vlogmas. It's day number 10. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Vlogmas number 10. We're going to call this the one that almost didn't get filmed. It is almost 7 o'clock at night and I'm just starting. And um, yeah, I just got dressed. I have pretty much done nothing all day long. Oh, but last night after I did uh, my Vlogmas number 9 with the wine, the fog, and my chili, I went downstairs and I got both copies of The Fog, the old one and the new one. And then I watched them side by side while I edited and uploaded my Vlogmas. And then I watched some other videos and did some commenting. And I was out here on this couch till about 7 o'clock this morning. And then I got up and it's like, oh, I might as well go to bed now, right? First I was thinking, well, maybe I should grab the sheets off my bed and get my laundry started I said yeah maybe maybe later I'm just gonna sleep for a few hours so anyway I went back to bed get up a few hours later I, I don't know why I just couldn't sleep and I came back out here grabbed a cup of coffee grabbed a Belgian waffle got that done sat on the couch boom I was out never drank my coffee never ate any of my Belgian waffle and I slept till about five o'clock tonight but you know what? I think I needed that. I think I just needed some good rest. And you get it on this couch. This couch, as much as I love it, it's probably the, one of the worst things I have ever bought because it's a magic couch. I know. So I used to have a living room set up here. And we basically moved downstairs because when we, we moved in, you know, the house was already done. Somebody else had built it and they did not like the house. They, whatever, they didn't like it. And so upstairs is white carpet. So the two bedrooms up here, the hallway, this uh, living room right here is white carpet. And then we've got um, oak floors in the kitchen, the dining room, the foyer, and the office. But... When you move in here and you've got puppies that like to go in and out and there's a sliding glass door that goes out to a deck but there's no stairs off the deck and when you've got great gains you really don't want them pooping in your front yard if you know what i mean so anyway the downstairs wasn't finished so we ended up finishing the downstairs got a new living room set down there put a bedroom in down there there was already a full bathroom we had a second kitchen put in I know how stupid is that right but oh my gosh we basically live downstairs and heating wise and air conditioning wise it was so much cheaper than having to heat the upstairs and it was convenient because the puppies could go out they could go run in the woods and the wetlands in the back and you didn't really have to worry about too much else you know other than when you know puppy five miles away was in heat and the males would find her five miles away two puppies did that right but yeah so anyway i had a nice living room set up here that was pretty much still brand new because we didn't really use it and i came home one day and this is when rick was was still good he i mean obviously he had some heart attacks and things but he had both legs he was still kind of working on his own doing some tooling things like that and i came home one day and my living room set was gone i had a couch up here a love seat a coffee table, two end tables, a sofa table. We had lamps on the end tables and it was gone. I came in and it's like, what the hey? So anyway, turns out one of his friends was separated from his wife. He didn't have any furniture. And Rick said, you know, why don't you just take the set? I never liked it. Nancy does, but I don't like it. Take it. So yeah, 
while I was working, his friend came over, some other friends came over, and they cleaned out the living room. Yeah. So, anyway, we just never really got, got around to doing it because, like I said, we were living basically downstairs. But, anyway, after everything happened, I kind of moved myself back upstairs, and I said, you know, I need a couch. So, I have no idea when it comes to proportion. I am not good at proportion or whatever. So I got this kind of this, you know, that kind of wraparound couch. It's got like the lounger on one side and it's just nice and comfortable. And as soon as you sit in that and you get a nice cozy blanket, chances are you're going to fall asleep. And one year for Thanksgiving, uh, Jeremy was um, doing some kind of race or whatever. So Raina came out with Maddie, Matt and Quinn. And it was a season that um, Stranger Things had started. So we were going to binge watch Stranger Things. And I think we probably woke up about two o'clock and all four of us were sleeping on the couch. It was just one of those things. You sit here, you're going to fall asleep and I dare you not to. And then even one year, Sabrina and the jelly beans and Mike came out. And Mike gets one of those like bean type things, these little skinny things never sleeps at night, never sleeps during the day, just, you know, one or two hours and he's good to go. And um, so we're sitting here, I think we probably had cartoons on for the kids, but they were sleeping on the couch anyway. And Sabrina and I were just talking. I think we were on the floor so we wouldn't fall asleep. And we look over and there's Mike sleeping away on the couch. It was crazy. And then another time, uh, Raina came out with Jeremy and Maddie Matt and Quinn. And of course, Jeremy's one of those people that's go, 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 never sleeps during the day. And so we're all kind of talking. The boys are on their, their laptops doing different things. And um, we look over, there's Jeremy, sound asleep. It's a magic couch. If you can't sleep, come on over this couch and you'll be sleeping in no time. So anyway, I finally got up about five today. I know, it takes, it takes me a while to kind of, kind of go around in a circle to get to the same point. But, so anyway, I got up. I said, oh, you know, I, I really got to get going because I'm not going to get my vlogmas in today. So I got my coffee heated up again. I said, well, I'll have my coffee first. So I went and sat in my office and did some work while I was having my coffee and kind of to wake up a bit. And I went and got ready and I came out and I said, you know, I need one more one more cup of coffee before I go do my video. So I have got the coffee that I pulled last night, which is the Green Mountain. It's the breakfast blend. It's really good. I got it in one of my favorite mugs that I think this is one of the last gifts that we got from my mom before she passed away. So I love these hand painted mugs that she got for us with these little Santa gnomes. So just gonna have a quick little sip. So good. And I got a Christmas card from Kim's Happy Place. So we're going to be opening that. I got some friend mail from Sherry. Beauty is you inside and out. I have no idea why, but I'm excited to get this. I just cut the tape on the bottom here and it is ready to explode. Both ladies are so wonderful. I'm going to talk a little bit more about them when I get into the unboxing them. My sparkling wine came in. Excuse me, because I'm probably going to make a noise when I pick this up. One, two, three. Okay. Here it comes. Ah, it's heavy. So I got my sparkling wine, my champagne to have between Christmas Day and New Year's Eve. And I really only needed one that had like seven, but they sold them in, in 12. So I'm going to have some extras. So I'm excited to get into this. I pretty sure it's still available on their website givethembeer.com they had advent calendars for wine as well um for beer of course givethembeer.com and um i think they had one for spirits like if um you know someone that does like whiskey and things like that they had uh, one with the spirits i'm gonna put this down i need one this this just takes a lot out of me one two three all righty sorry for the noise Alrighty, I think I might need one more nap, but I got my coffee. Oh, and then, final. So while I was checking my email while I was went into my office um, today, 
I had an email from Vino and I was like, hmm, I wonder if they have a sale. But it was for a free box. So I'm like, oh my gosh, a free box. I can do that. So it was a free box, but you just had to pay for shipping, which was like 1980 something or 1989. So about $20. But it would be the box that we just got. Uh, with the two bottles of wine and the goodies that are in it. So I'm thinking, wow, that's pretty nice. I think I'll offer this. So, of course, it's only for, so I click on it. It's like, why would they send it to me? It's for new subscribers only. So, but anyway, while I'm here, and once I go in the other room, I'll get the details, and I'll just let you know if you are interested in doing the vino. And again, you don't need anybody's link. I don't know if anybody's link would work on this. Uh, the box is free. You just pay for shipping. So it's going to be just under $20. It's going to be the two bottles of wine and all the goodies, and I'll probably have that video linked up there so you can see just what was in it. I think the value was like $146. It was really good. And um, yeah, so I'm going to finish my coffee. I'm going to get my head headband on and um, get ready to do an unboxing and show the ugly Christmas sweater of the day. I can't promise that I'm not going to fall asleep again, but yeah, I just might. So anyway, stay tuned and I will see you guys in a few minutes. Hi everyone. Welcome back. So we are here for the fun part so anyway we are well let's just start with the ugly outfit of the day so i've got my antlers on i've had these on already um i've got these uh little light bulb earrings that i got from shane this is actually some red pearls that i've had for quite a few years the rings i have on are from heidi douse and i think i got the sweater at kohl's maybe last year maybe the year before and it's got lots of bling on it. We've got Rudolph with his red nose. He's got sunglasses on because his nose is so bright. We've got some snowflakes. We've got his antlers with a hat. We've got ugly sweater details and some little colorful balls around the neck and some foiled snowflakes. Just have leggings on today. Just a quick, comfortable day. So the coffee that we picked out to have tomorrow and I do love this I've had this one before this is from the donut shop and this is peppermint bark so we will probably have that maybe focus please maybe mid-morning tomorrow the chocolate from the lint calendar and we've already picked out number 10 that I think was right here We've got one of those little mini lint truffles. These are so good. I do like the full size much better. Yeah, because it's just more flavor. There's more to chew. Alrighty, so the wine that we picked out, and I've only got, stay 10, I've got two more days in this before I switch to the one from QVC. So this one is a Sauvignon Blanc. And the sweater here. I put my handy dandy elastic on already. So let's try to open this up. So I hope everyone's a Saturday is going good. Like I said earlier, I have slept most of the day away and I'm fine with that. Sometimes I think we just need a day to catch up. So I got my nutcracker glass. And let's see if we can figure out what it smells like. It smells fruity. Maybe like a peach, a, me a melon, and maybe even some something tart like a green apple. Alrighty. Cheers, everyone. I'm going in. Of course, if I drink the whole thing and go back on that couch, I'll be sleeping. Here you go. Mmm. It's dry, but it's sweet at the same time. You got that sensation. And I mean, it didn't even really dry out the top of my mouth, but it was uh, definitely aged in probably some oak barrels. Not like um, maybe they were a new barrel. I don't get any other taste with it. Definitely green apple, some melon, maybe some peach. So anyway, that's good. So let's move along. So we got this card from Kim from Kim's Happy Place. Of course, we've got some stickers on this and a nice Santa sticker in the back. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. So if you don't know Kim, 
and I'm sure if you watch me, you've watched Kim. She is a wonderful, wonderful lady. She is her and her mom, her husband are all struggling with Arona right now. So send some prayers uh, her way, especially her mom. She's uh, got COPD. She's had a heart issue. So any prayers that you can send her way will be greatly, greatly appreciated. Kim hasn't really been on YouTube that long. I'm thinking maybe a year, maybe two years. She's already over a thousand. She's helped so many of us uh, by getting the word out and sharing channels and um, doing giveaways to help people reach their thousand subscriber goal. So just a wonderful, wonderful lady. She does a lot of unboxings. She's got an adorable little puppy, Chloe Bell. So cute. And yeah, so she just does unboxing this year. Eye makeup is really, really fun. She does some really great looks. She likes to do like Shane hauls and things like that. So yeah, really fun. She likes to go antiquing too. So nice when she takes us along. So anyway, back to her card. What the? And on the new carpet too. Bad dog. Bad, bad dog. So it's a snowman dog. Pooping ice cubes. All right, it is so cute. So I'm sure you've been very, very good this year. I have, I think. So anyway, Merry Christmas. And you should even put LOL. Um, have a safe and blessed holiday season, my friend. Love, Kim. So just really, really sweet. Thank you so much, Kim. I appreciate this so much. I am still getting my cards. I mean, I've got my cards. I've got my labels made. I've got my stamps ordered. I just, I usually like to try to write in the cards just to kind of make it personal. And that's what takes me so long. So I'm thinking this year, if I want to get them out, I'm just going to have to do something quick and simple. So if you get a card from me and it just says Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, or Happy Holidays, please don't take it personal. I'm just, I just want to get them out so that they can get there before Christmas. Alrighty, so next I have this box from Sherry from Beauty Is You with You inside and out. She is a really, really remarkable lady. She is so beautiful and she could be a model and just, she lives in Florida. She lives in Crystal River, Florida, which is really fun because um, my great uncle and great aunt um, shared a crystal uh a business in Crystal River with my grandparents after they uh, sold off the carnival, the traveling carnival that they had. And they had a glass bottom boat business for tourism that they ran out of Crystal River. They did that for years. And so it's just fun to hear that name after knowing that there's kind of like a connection there between us. So that was really fun. But anyway, Sherry. Like I said, she's adorable. She's a puppy lover. Just such a really, really nice lady. She's at like 392 last time I checked. She's been dying to get to 400 for so long. So if you could share, and I'll have her information as well as Kim uh, in my description below, if you could maybe help her out, get to her 400 subscriber goal, maybe share out that channel with people you know. She's just a really remarkable lady. She does unboxings and she does like get ready with me and she's a nice chatty type person. She also has another channel. I'm going to say the beauty is you inside and out. That's kind of more like her more formalized channel where she behaves herself quite well. And then her other channel, Makeup Pause and Me, is where she's kind of like more relaxed it's her casual channel where maybe she does more chit chats and talking about her puppies and relaxes with you know having a cigarette every now and then just a really really nice lady that channel I think it's just over a hundred so she's trying to grow both channels so any help that you could give her would be greatly appreciated and again she sent me this box I am not sure why and it is like busting at the seams all right, so that is what it looks like. We've got some squirrelies. Oh, we've got a card and a face mask. Because she knows I love to face mask. Little penguin here from Planist. So that should become, it's a firming 
facial mask. I'm going to enjoy that. And Miss Nancy, it just got a butterfly on the back. All right. Aww, look at the little puppy. Some things just fill your heart without trying. Oh, isn't that puppy adorable? I love puppies. I just love puppies. And so many stickers inside here. It's so pretty. And a while ago, one of her puppies, Maxwell, Sir Max, wasn't doing too well and she had some emergency vet visits with him and uh, he was having some trouble chewing and things like that and so I sent some toys for him and his uh, puppy brothers and um, yeah so she just says she wanted to thank to say thank you and Maxwell thanks you too I wanted to send this sooner but life got in the way I know at Sherry's she's had some health issues too with um, um, health problems like in her lungs and breathing and just running out of breath and being tired. She's had pneumonia and just really having a tough time of it. Um, so I cherish and appreciate you and your good loving heart. This is just a little gift from Maxwell and me. Love and hugs. Sherry, beauty is you. XOXO. Sherry also has quite a belief in aliens and I do too. So she might share some stories with you. Alrighty, so first I see we've got this Refresh and Reset. It's a brightening mud mask. So that's still in the plastic here, so we will leave that. Otherwise, if I open up everything that's in here, it's probably going to take a while. Alrighty, so we've got... Okay, bubble wrap in this box here. Let's see if we can put it up and see what it is. Michael Kors Sexy Ruby Bear the Perfume. Alrighty. I can get it out of the box. Cute little bottle. The diamond facets. I don't know if it's a pump. A stopper. Mm, it smells nice. Smells really, really nice. Thank you so much, Sherry. Again, you did not have to do this at all. Alrighty, and it's more. Alrighty, so we've got some nails in here from Lily and Fox. C'est la vie. So, Paris themed nails. Those are so pretty. Very colorful. I took mine off a while ago and I haven't put them back on yet. And looks like another set of nails in here. Maybe those are toenails. Alrighty. Okay, we've got this big package here, but let's take out the box first. So, oh, checklist, wine glass. Happy Euphoria. Or home Euphoria. Sometimes I just make up my own words. Alrighty. And bubble wrap. Alrighty. You put a piece of paper in here so we can see what it says. Bra off, hair up, sweats on, pop cork. Sherry, how well you know me. So that is a nice, nice wine glass. You know I am going to enjoy using that. And it looks like we got one more thing here. And everything was so well protected. This looks like a coffee mug. Alrighty. I wish you lived next to me. Oh, it's personalized. I'm sorry about that. Nancy and Sherry. I wish she did too because she could help me with my makeup. I could play with her puppies and we could sit and have coffee together. Yeah. Or what? I don't think she, she drinks alcohol, but I think she likes her coffee. So we would get a long time. And I'm pretty sure that's it. So if I miss something, Sherry, I will find it later. But thank you so much, you and Max, 
that was very very nice he did not have to do that but i appreciate it so much and i know this is going to be a longer video than usual because i did a little pre-video in the other room when i was too lazy to get up off the couch i tell you that couch <sighs> yeah it's so great so anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for joining me for Vlogmas Day 10. We hope to see you tomorrow for number 11. And Monday will be my last day with this box before I switch to the other one. So anyway, thanks again, everyone. I hope you go out, enjoy the rest of the weekend. Be safe, everyone. Take care. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have fun. Have fun. Don't forget to check out Kim's Place and Sherry. Beauty is you. And again, I will have those lovely ladies linked below. Don't forget about the buy now uh, to get your free box. You just have to pay for shipping. So it's just under $20. I will probably take a snapshot of that email that they sent so that you can go online and order that. And again, I'll have my video that'll be linked up there somewhere to show you the five items that came with it. It was a really good box. Lots of and lots of fun and looking forward to seeing you guys later. Take care, everyone. Love you guys so much. Bye-bye.